Many of these operations are hid within uh, humanitarian organizations and private security organizations. There's a, a an unholy alliance, if you will, between uh, what I would term as professional military organizations, organizations which essentially provide personal support. Uh, they move people around. They provide personal security. Uh, these uh, companies partner with these humanitarian companies essentially to help move and protect people who who are at risk. And many of the very people who are supposedly good folks, we saw this uh, with Silsby and uh, I think it was uh, uh, in, Haiti. Uh, in Haiti, where they pretend to be uh, religious based uh, uh, humanitarian helping organizations, which really they're just intakes, they're scouting, assessing, and, and obtaining. Uh, the most vulnerable people who will not be missed. Uh, one of the tragic things, Jack, as you kind of alluded to when you were talking about uh, the fact that these kids don't have parents is who's going to miss these kids? They are literally disposable. So you combine this these humanitarian organizations which supposedly want to help these people. They shelter them. They, they, they put them up. They have them available to, to, to these other private security organizations who can move them around quietly, internationally, uh, put them on a private plane, who checks? Uh, it, it, it is easily missed by the mainstream media. So that's why nobody wants to talk about how easy it is to move kids with no parents around using uh, humanitarian organizations with private security firms. It just it, it's hidden in plain sight.